do one of her activities, but this is before school. I found crocodile. A... Crocodile begins with the letter. Cur. So where's Curly Cur? Well done. Can you name any of the animals in Welsh as well? Key. Yeah. Uh, dog. Dog. Dog begins with. I want you to put them on the English name, though, Bobby. That's it, because key begins with curly cur, but dog begins with duh. So put them and do them in English first, and then we'll name them in Welsh. Well done. Lion, lion which begins with the same letter, llaw and lion. Do you know what that? Do you know what cat that is? It's got spots, so it's a leopard. Let's so find the luck card. So there's more than one animal for each card. Yeah, but there's more than one animal for each card, baby. There's about two animals for each card. Uh, lion. Well, she's doing this. Love. I managed to find a bell last night, so I've told her what we're going to try and do today as a, t as a teacher is I'm going to try and give her an, uh, an idea of what school is actually like. So she's been told after breakfast... The school is not that bell, though. Not that bell, Bab. Um, our school day will start with a bell, and then break time will be bell uh, this and stuff. So this bell, I'm going to try and give an idea of what schools. This bell, this bell. Other this than the bell. lack of children. This bell, this bell. No, because the teacher controls the bell, and you can do that one, Bobby. That's one thing you got to learn about school. It's not in your control, baby. Okay. We're going to finish. We're going to finish off our animals. Rosie to collect and bring me the number twenty-three. Two, three, twenty-three. Where's the number 23? Two, three. Two, three, 23. Two, three, 23. Well done. Sorry. Me, thank you. Okay, can you help Mika find the number two? Two. So these are her classmates today. We've done a little circle time on the floor with a story. We've done some reading time. Number two, Mika. Can you find me the number two? We read the ugly duckling and then whilst they were drawing pictures of ducklings and stuff at the desk, I called them one by one to read. Okay, Ro uh, Rosie, can you help Jenny find the number 11? So she's getting to see what she'd have to do. So we did our, we did our weather clock. We did our clock, weather clock, time clock. The number 11, please, Jenny. Wait, I'm searching for it. Yeah. And then, um, so after reading now, we're doing some physical exercise with some numbers. But the teacher today, she's learning what it's like in a school. So we're now at break time in our school day, even though it's not actually anywhere near break time. How? How was the weather, Bob? Well, you were right. I got you all to predict the weather on our little chart, didn't I? And you said you thought it'd be sunny today, and you're right, it's going to be sunny. So I'm trying to show her what a real school with an actual teacher would be like. Like, no preference or treated exactly the same as all the others. Um. I did the bounces! Yeah, it's good practice. Do you want me to put Mila on the chair so you don't accidentally bounce on her? Then you've got the whole thing to bounce on. Put Mila there. Poor oh, Mila. using a bell so that she understands that um, schools work by bells. So she had a bell to start the day, a bell to start break time. I've come out in the garden for the first time in quite a while and realised how much work we've quite got to do. So two legs, Bab, spend two legs. We've done some maths, we've done some English, we've done some reading, she's done some pen control. The difference between today as a teacher and our normal day as a teacher is not that we don't always get everything done, but I'm being less flexible today. I'm being, we have to do this much of this. But we started at eight o'clock instead of nine. School started at nine, we started at eight. Um, so break time is now earlier now at nine o'clock. Because um, she just didn't want to wait. She wanted to start doing it, so. Let's go so, in the cover. Yeah, I think she's enjoying it. I'm just going to move my tea because otherwise she's going to knock my tea over. And back to the door. Can you flap like a bird to the table? 
burn the table. Mm, that's running. Okay, back to the door. <laughs> Can you flap your arms like a bird to the table? Flap, 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 flap. I can do that. And back. Back to the door. Back to the door. Can you snap like a crocodile to the table? All the way down to the table. Yum, 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 yum. And back to the door. Can you wiggle your bottom like a duck all the way to the table? Like a duck. Whack, 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 whack. Wiggle your bum. Whack, 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 whack. It did whack, it! Whack, 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 whack. And back down. Waggle your bum like a duck, like a duck. Can you waddle like a penguin to the table? <laughs> and can you, last one, back to the door. Last one. Can you crawl like a dog on all fours to the, to the table? That's it. There we go. Oh, well done. Well so done. Today's video has been mostly about um, me being a teacher to Rosie because we did try. Um, sorry, excuse me here. We did try reversing it. We did try um, her doing being the teacher, and she wasn't really sure what to do. She was more happy to follow instructions than to try and give them as much as she is a little bossy boot sometimes. So she's currently doing play doh with daddy. There's one last thing. School day at this age would only last half a day anyway, so um, yeah, um, I do look a state, sorry, I fell asleep. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's uh, yeah, it wasn't really preschool teachers role play for the little ones, but more to show when we when we, we YouTubed it, we went to look for a video of what is a teacher for like a, a preschooler. And it just came up with different circle times. So we we've just put in today what we do as part of our preschool day. Um, just I wasn't as flexible with her today, and I was stricter with her, and I didn't let her wiggle around as much because I knew they they wouldn't let her in a school. So um, yeah, she just got a bit more of an idea of if she did go to school, it would be it would be stricter on her, and I think she likes our freedom. So yeah. Uh, I hope it was useful to anyone. If it was, please comment below, like and subscribe, and we'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow is, I think we're doing vets tomorrow. So it's a tar from me and a tar from the Rosie Bear.